ingredients, chicken teriyaki, cooked chicken, chicken, meat, salt, soy sauce, wheat, soybean, salt, alcohol, vinegar, lactic acid, brown sugar, sucrose, invert sugar, cane molasses, bamboo shoot, mushroom, red pepper, green peas, Salt, modified cornstarch, sherry wine, fancy stuff, wine salt, sulfites, onion, green pepper, garlic powder, spice. Well, seems like quite the lunch. I had a couple of guys over here to the behind me, behind that other car. I didn't want to make too much noise. They were kind enough they didn't make a peep. So I didn't want to narrate in the camera too much. Disturb their peace and quiet that they probably came here for. What we're doing right now is we used this Stanley camp top cooker. Camp fire cooking, excuse me stainless steel cooker it's um uh, I don't know it's a 20 ounce stainless steel canister and you uh, pinch that lid that lock peel it over and that gives you a, a handle and there are two insulated nesting cups inside. Uh, this is a little bit more expensive than most of anything you've probably seen me use in the past. I'm kind of a $5 guy for stuff, but uh, this is light, fits in your backpack. A lot of backpackers and hikers probably use this. Work pretty well, and uh, it being so small, it boiled two cups of water in maybe two minutes on that uh, camp burner that we have that we showed you last time. We just boiled some water to make one of these and review it. This is the uh, Mountain Pack Chicken Teriyaki. Most any outdoorsman seen these before. This has a lot of carbohydrates in it. So if you were trying to avoid the carbohydrates, this ain't for you. I noticed after the fact, but I'm gonna eat my lunch. Pretty good though. I mean, for, you know, dehydrated food. Some of the chicken. That's a weird texture. It hasn't hydrated enough. I let it go like 10 minutes. Directions called for eight <coughs> to nine. But if you're hungry out in the field, these carry well. Throw them in a the backpack, keep them in the back of your car. Just boil two cups of water, put them in the pack. Don't even have to have a plate. Do need a utensil though.
Somebody should come up with one that has a utensil tape to it. Or maybe the part you rip off could be a spoon. Could be a thousand dollar idea right well, there. For what it is, the chicken teriyaki, I give it a solid five. This thing works really well. It is small, lightweight, and easy to carry. And for those reasons, I give it a... I forgot to take that sticker off. I wonder it didn't catch on fire. <laughs> Dumb place for a sticker. Oh, lightweight, fit in your backpack, easy to carry. Yeah, I'd recommend it. Uh, Stanley has been around for a long time. They are the granddaddy of them uh, for quality and outdoor uh, thermal and cookware. You want a Stanley? I have a Stanley coffee thermos at home I've had for a while. Uh, that I really enjoy. However, this thing retails for about $19.99, about $20 for that little thing. So they are a bit on the uh, pricier side. But I would give this an 8, 8.5, eh, maybe even a 9 out of 10 for its lightweight, convenience, and durability. And the, the two cups inside, so you could uh, make something, split it with a friend with the two cups inside. Although, the ideal of these is no unnecessary cleanup. So you just pour these in the bowl. These mountain pack meals, you boil two cups of water, 473 milliliters. There's a milliliter measurement on the, the cup thing there. Just add it to the, the uh, pouch and you let it rehydrate for about, <clears throat> directions say eight to nine minutes. I go ahead and give it 10 to 11. Especially uh, anything with uh, meat, I guess, in it. It's gonna take a little extra time to hydrate. As a meal, solid five. Tastes all right, doesn't taste homemade doesn't taste better than any of the rice my Spanish wife and folks make. It's just all right. But if you're out in the field and you need something convenient, easy to carry, easy to easy to carry and easy to prepare. A lot of us outdoorsmen have used these for years. Still do. So it's a solid five in rating. Would I recommend it? Yeah. Especially when it's getting colder outside, you're going to burn through calories out here. So, to have a nice hot meal at the ready, that's worth it a lot. If you want to pick up one of these for yourself, I'll leave the link to Stanley in the description box below, as well as the link to Mountain Pack. You can also pick them up at your local Walmart. We want to thank you so much for watching another video of Blue Collar Fishing. Hey, if you're new here, if you haven't already, we'd really appreciate it if you consider subscribing notified of all our videos go ahead and click that go ahead and click that notification bell if you like these videos we really appreciate if you smash the thumbs up on your way out it really helps our channel grow comment down below to let us know what you use and what you carry into the field with you hey thanks for watching tight lines everybody we'll see you next time